Hello everybody and welcome back to No Place Like Home where we're uh, very much now into the uh, the Lonely Hills exploration part of the game and I'm currently trying to find my way through the underground um, trying to find Sir Cornelius trying to collect duck eggs and ducks in general some preserving pots over here I'm at the point now where I'm just like chucking food in to try and just keep it down and keep the keep the amount I have to store down honestly that's probably mostly what I'm doing um, I'm sticking farm plots in here I don't feel that I need a ton of them around all the time um, put a little bit more trash in there I am kind of picking up more trash than I'm processing at the moment still which is kind of crazy but never mind. Um, we need to upgrade the kitchen at some point to get like that big stuffed pumpkin, but I'm trying really hard to save up, and I just want to save up one more duck egg, so the duck egg tomorrow will be enough, hopefully, for me to uh, grab that purple drill bit. And then I'll know how many components I need to make it, and then I'll know how many components I've got left over at the end. So while we're waiting for that to happen, I'm going to jump back down into the sewers. And uh, one of the first things I will be making will be um, a camp set thing. We still don't have this door open. I'm so intrigued by this. I'm like, where does that one go? But you can't uh, spend too long worrying about that sort of thing. Um, as I say, I'm going to eventually clear all of this up and I'll eventually know where everything goes and how to get into everything. They are slowly but surely getting more and more and more stuff opened out. I know this will be back tomorrow if I take it away. It always is. It's just so annoying, one little bit of stuff. Okay, so. I am just going to head straight out to the Lonely Hills. And it is pretty much forward, straight, uh, sorry, forward, and then go to the left, and then turn to the right again, so you're just doing a little sort of dog leg there. We've got this area cleaned up now. And then take another left, so it's, it's kind of like a little sort of straightened out Z shape. And then we're through to the Lonely Hills here. But there is another way into the Lonely Hills. And there are more bits to this than I really know. But this is the way that I know to get to the Lonely Hills quickly. So it is rather helpful. We'll check around here. I think I already did check around here. But I wanted to make sure I wasn't missing anything. I'm also going to just hoover up some of the junk piles in this area. Like I say, I don't want to go too overboard on any one day because it does, uh, it takes up time. It takes up a few minutes of my time that could be spent. And then, you know, if I then sort of run out of time at the end of the day by a few minutes, I'm going to be kicking myself, aren't I? So. And I'm actually going to go up the ladder. I won't go up the ladder down here. I actually think it's quicker to get back to... Rudy and Co by going up the ladder this way. Um, I'm gonna just check out this area again, just to make sure. I mean, there's still buttons that I don't know what they do. Oh, I know what they do. Oh man, I could have so used that when I was beating up the dudes. Look what they do. They change around the... The balls. So that they go in a different direction. But other than that, it doesn't look like there's anything interesting in here. So I'm just going to carry on. But yeah, when you guys do that, that's what you can do. <laughs> you can shoot them. It's awesome. Shoot all the robots. Oh, that would have been so fun. Mind you, I had quite a lot of fun anyway. But, you know. 
I feel like we could do with a bit of clean up around here as well. Seems that I'm coming around here all the time. But yeah, I just need to find like any entrances into the underground and try and just work them out and try and work out where I am and what I'm doing and stuff. I couldn't get over there. As much as that looks like it should be an entrance into the underground, they couldn't work that one out at all. There's like enemies over there. And if there's enemies, there's usually interesting stuff, in my opinion. In my experience. Okay, this is interesting. I don't really go anywhere though. No, can't get anywhere from there. Okay. Let's try and head down the river. And see what we get down there, see what we find. But I think we need to somehow get onto the other side of this good old gander around. Oh, that's what this is all about. There's a suitcase down here with, I thought it had dynamite in it for a second there, but quality wood. Quality wood is something I'm definitely collecting, so that's really cool. But no, it doesn't look like there's anything down here. There's definitely a, one of those stinky trash heaps that I need to pour water on down there as well, so we need to work that out. Um, so I'm thinking, do I just walk up this tree branch to get to the other side here? I do indeed. I'm going to run around sucking up trash. I think by the time I finish here, this might be quite nicely done. Um, I don't know. You ran away from your healer, noob mistake. Noob and error. Love that sound. <laughs> if anyone doesn't like that sort of sucking sound, then I imagine this game would be pretty terrible. <laughs> but I love it. done. There are a lot of robots around here and there's one of those big gigantic um, spitter robots as well which is kind of interesting. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Ow, ow, that wasn't good. I'll try and hoover it before any of the spitters get me or its little friend over there gets me. Whoa, get out of here now. This is dangerous place. I did say there'd be a lot of company around there though, so that's uh, maybe a good indication that I'm, in, I'm getting towards the right place. I don't know. Mm, no, stop it. That one was really annoying. <laughs> No, oh dear. The ground makes it hard to see the green there. Okay. Let's see if I can find a way through that has like less danger. You can see the robot's little heads like poking out, so you can try to avoid them. I will probably eventually get them, but for now I shall avoid them. A 
big boss robot over there as well. This definitely looks like a place that's got interesting stuff in it. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! My health is way too low for this. Ah! I'm not gonna be a big old coward and run away. So you're a normal robot. Oh, you've got one of those annoying robot friends. Okay, well I did the trash heap. Over here, which is wonderful. I'm not sure that I'm going to have enough... Spend some of the day cleaning it up. <sighs> yeah, I'm not sure I'm going to have health to carry on, I don't think. I think that would just be a mistake. Ah! Let's have a look at my quests quickly while I'm here. What do I got left to do here? So I've done all the re rebuilding the village. I've still got some animal adventures to do, but uh, Noxious Trees, I've got one more to find. Barred doors, I need an ultimate fruit salad for. Need to find one more key part. I need to get eight quality wood and Olivier salad. I can't remember whether I've got that or not. Place pasture on the woodlet. And get ducks. Okay, how many carrots do I have to get ducks with? Like, one. So I need way more carrots. Give me carrots. Run away. <laughs> run away, Sheila, run away. Run away. I can see one, like, hiding in there, too. I imagine there'd be loads of carrot seeds in here, but I've just got to like, get to them. die because I've really done badly. I've done very, very poorly with the fighting around here, which is why I'm going to have to come back another day and finish it off. But so far I've not done very well with finding like any other entrances to the um, underground from here. And I know there must be, there's another like section to it. So I'm kind of confused just exactly what I need to do and where I need to go. But so far I've only seen two entrances to the underground in here. And uh, they're both connected together and neither of them really allow me to go much further than I've already been. So I'm kind of a little bit confused as to exactly- Oh! I see you hiding in that trash! I think I need to leave this area. I'm, I'm totally coming back here though. It's really cool. Absolutely coming back here. I'm just gonna like run around and uh, hoover up trash piles and tidy up and stuff until I pass out. I do feel like the area is slowly becoming nicer as I am moving around and slowly hoovering things up around here, but. I think there's still more exploration to be done by far. I think I see another trash heap. I think I see the last one. And it's up there. How in blazes do I get up there? 
but that's where it is. I won't get a chance, I don't think, today to explore that, but it's cool. It's very cool. I think uh, I think I know where that last one is. I just have to work out how to get there. Oh, carrots! Yes! That's the answer to my duck problem. Fantastic. I might need them for my deer as well. Oh, there we go. It is 10 o'clock and I passed out. Okay, so today hopefully should be the day that I get uh, my purple upgrade and I can stop having to hoard the components because I don't know how many I'm going to need, you see. I don't know how much trash I actually have here, but we'll keep going. This is duck egg number three. So let's go in there. Oh, okay, you need a bath, do you? Okay. I've stopped even worrying about the chickens because I don't need their eggs now. It's, I know, it is maybe a bit mean, but it's the efficient way to play the game, okay? Uh, otherwise I'll be there, I'll spend half the day looking after my chickens and uh, no time doing anything else. Now, I'm kind of interested about down here. Good day, Ellen, what brings you here? What recipes can you teach me? Can you teach me this one? Yes, you can, wonderful. I'm going to come back up here and I'm going to do a little bit of exploring around there, I think. But the first thing I want to do, the pigs have got truffle, everything is, everything is ready to harvest on this farm. The honey is ready, the eggs are ready, the truffles are ready. Okay, and as expected, it's glue required, so rubber waste. Rubber waste. We are able to do that now. So I would also like there's some things I haven't done yet. I'd like a super kitchen, but uh we're not quite there with that yet. Super recycler just costs glue. So I think we should start like making some super recyclers. With our glue. And plant the carrots as well. Um, super recycler. Where'd you go? Ah, uh, I can I never find anything in this inventory? Oh, because it's already on my hotbar. Oh yeah, I could make some mayonnaise with my eggs, couldn't I? Not that I need mayonnaise that much either, honestly. Okay, so it only required, oh I forget how many it required now, not many, I still have 10 components left so probably 2 or something. So I definitely think that at this point um, looking at other upgrades and things would be really cool. So upgrades, what else have we got? We have crafted expanded in inventory 2, but we could really do, oh 5 for expanded inventory 3. Ooh. Six for augmented drill. I think bigger crops is particularly something I'm interested in. Water tank, absolutely necessary. Toughness three, yeah. Improved water tank, yeah. And the reason I've done those two as opposed to anything else, is that those two help me fight. Those two are the ones that will help me fight my way through all of these uh, underground layer areas. And I've got enough inventory space to go down again. Uh, I will clean it out. I promise. Hang on a minute. No, I wanted to do something a bit different. I wanted to see about going from a different perspective. So what I want to do is um, head around this way 
and go down the part of the underground that's by Rudy up here. I just want to see what it's looking like and how many doors are open down there and stuff at the moment. See if I can work anything out about it. Because this looks like it's an almost, it was almost like a, a part on its own, wasn't it? This one. It's kind of its own little, its own little bit. Um, and it really, yeah, it really is very self-contained. Okay, that's fine. There really is nothing more in this one. I just wanted to check on it, you know, I just wanted to make sure. I wasn't missing out on something awesome. Yeah, I'm just going to jump back down there, I think, and just see what I can find. I'm a little bit tougher now. I've got more. I've got 400 water instead of 300, so that should last me a bit longer, provided I remember to fill it up. Which I shall do before I go exploring. So I, I at least know the way to go to get the uh, to get to the lo the lonely hills. But like, there's definitely like um, around the area. I think it was down here somewhere or something. This area, and then there was like I think we went through another door down here. Oh no, we didn't. Okay. But I'm certain there was like, um, there was like an arena. I don't know how it really connects up, but there was an arena. Um, no, it's not here. This is... Oh, actually, hang on, because through here there were some interesting doors and things, weren't there? I'm starting to remember where landmarks are and things now. There's this whole area here that we've managed to open up now. And did we open up... Oh yeah, and we've opened up the other side. And this might be the area I'm talking about, I'm not sure. Yeah, this area here, and there was another door here that goes through into what I think is the Lonely Hills from another perspective, but I can't get this door open. If I was able to get to the other side of that, I would know I would be able to open it because I can literally see the button like right through there. I th well, I think I can. Maybe I can't. But that kind of interests me too. There's nothing I can do about it right now. But that makes me think that there's more more to the Lonely Hills than I've done so far. And this pops up. I don't know whether it's relative or anything, but it pops up here. Oh. You know what? I bet. Do you think there's like a way in around here? somewhere into the because that looks like it's this direction and that there's a way into the underground from here also there was a thing down here that I hadn't been able to get rid of so far there was like a dumpster here but I couldn't get rid of the rubber waste until now and now I can But yeah, that looks like the way into the underground from this direction. That's super interesting. Poached peach. Peach and honey. That was worth a check, wasn't it? Worth a look. Actually, I must have killed something around there. But yeah, I'm certainly not seeing any like underground 
ways in around here. So that's what I'm maybe thinking is that it's maybe the reason I can't get in is because it's it joins up here. Don't know. head back in this way I think so yeah all in all this is very confusing <laughs> and I still can't find my way down oh okay so let's get to the lonely hills I probably won't even be able to do what I want to do now um, one of the things that I wanted to do today and I might not get the chance to now because I've been mucking around trying to work out how things uh, fit together I, re I do reckon that that is going through into this area. I reckon it's an underground for there rather than the Lonely Hills underground. But I could be wrong. So there was a trash heap that I wanted to try and work out how to get to. It's the last one. And it was kind of on top of... Um, a big hill. Can't really see it now. Can't see it from here. But let's run down and try and find it anyway. So, oh, no, there's one down there. Okay. Well, we definitely need to get that one then. There might be more than ten. Just because it's asked me to get ten doesn't mean there's not more than ten. There were things that I couldn't get past down here. There was like a gate I couldn't get through. Of course, I didn't have the stuff to do it. Um, no, I need to go this way. There was this, this trashy pier I was able to get and do. And this one I just... Oh yeah, it had purple trash in front of it. So that's why I couldn't do that one. I knew where it was, I just couldn't do it because of the purple trash. Because of the rubber waste. So we have completed noxious fumes. Woo! I got some more components as well, so we'll definitely be able to. I should have make it made a camp kit really, but I, I don't know. Like, I never make it back to the campsite. I'm always like too busy doing things, and then I get knocked out. So probably not worth worrying about really. Hey little deer, I'm just busy kind of like cleaning this up, okay? I'm trying to clean up this little area. Oh man, I hate it when my trash falls in the river. I feel like, I feel like such a, such a litterer. There's not a lot I can do. Especially when it's a really deep river like this one. Kind of annoys me as well that I can't um, like dig up the trash heaps after I put water on them. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, you know what? There is one other entrance to the. Um, that I haven't really explored very much yet. And that's the one up by Rudy, the, the very, very initial one that we went into. I just thought about that one. I'm super happy that we've done the Noxious Fumes quest though, because that was really cool. I'll come down here and do more tidying at, at some other juncture. So yeah, let's go and um, see if there's more to that area. I'm stronger now, I know how to fight better, um, so I think I will do a lot of, of a better job at that one. Oh wow, there's like, these trash heaps are everywhere. Oops. Would help if I activated the door instead of trying to run through it. But yeah, this area here... Had like um, a, it had a door here. 
right? It has like, oh, it just needs a battery. Really, that was all we needed? Oh, it's that door. It is that door. <gasps> Man. There you go. I just didn't know what to do with that door. And, and then when I came back to it, I was like, actually, I do know what to do with that door because we've done stuff with it before. Ah, uh, so good. Die. Yes. So we can work out how to get into here a bit more. Still haven't quite worked out that gate though down the bottom and I, I, that's going to probably bug me. Okay, so this one. There's water in there. I don't see a button. All oh, right, that one has um, a gate on the other side. You have to put a box on the other side of it. So I think that's as far as this one will go so far. That looks like it's got stuff underneath it. Need dynamite or something. But yeah, that goes through into the uh, the other area. So that was cool. That was super cool. But I think th there's no more to it than this. But I'm glad I got that door open because that's a handy way through to this section of the Lonely Hills. Okay, then we've got this here. Ah, okay, so this looks like it goes a bit further. Oh no, yeah, apparently it does not. But there's a suitcase I missed. Nice. Glad I came back in here to have a little nose. Little mosey about, little nose. Yeah, somewhere in here I'll I'll press some nondescript button somewhere and uh, I won't know what it's done and I'll come out and the gate will be open. I won't know where it is at all. So where does this come out? What? Oh man. Um. Hello? Oh, how weird. I couldn't even click on the go back home button then. Was it really 10 o'clock already at that point? Goodness me. Okay, I think I need to make some, some camping supplies. I do want the super kitchen upgrade as well though. Oh, I just don't know. I don't know what I want anymore. Okay, let's go and see Mark and go see if we can get a super kitchen upgrade because I want to get that big pumpkin and get... I just want to unlock all the recipes, really, don't I? And I want to start working on my little house as well, do some house things. All right, what's the recipes? So this one... Oh, yeah, I've got to make the fruit salad, the pepperonata thing. I've done everything else. Okay. Maybe I could just do that for for a day. We could just work on recipes for a day. I'm just going back and forward and, and and then I'll know that they're all unlocked sort of thing. So let's make a pepperonata. Might not be able to do it, but I'm pretty sure I can make a basic fruit salad. And a pepperonata thing. Wherever it is. I know I had it. This one. 
I need tomatoes. Okay. Get some tomatoes out. And make a pepperonata thing. Done. And done. So let's go get those last two off of Mark. And then I'll build the kitchen upgrade, but probably not the other upgrades quite yet. Unless those upgrades don't cost me components, and then I'll just do them. Because that'll be fine. So that, my friendos, is all of Mark's recipes done. So I just want to head over to Gramps quickly and just see what kind of things I need for Gramps' recipes. Because I've kind of forgotten exactly what I need over here. And I would like to see... I need to do a quick sweep around here and just like get all the little bits and pieces that have uh, respawned over time. Hey Napoleon! Awesomest pig ever. Okay, so we've got all of those. Got those. So I need that big pumpkin and I can't do that quite yet so that's for the bigger crops. And that is the only thing I need to do over here. Oh okay. Coolio. So let's, um, I'll go on the overground. Let's go to Rudy and his friend. And quickly see if they've got some extra stuff that I can unlock. But basically I'm, st I'm stuck behind a stuffed pumpkin that I need an upgraded kitchen for. So we need to do that next time we're on the farm. Let's see what else Rudy will will give us. I do need to finish off the ducks. I do need to plant carrots for that. So that's something I need to do as well. And there's a few things I need to do, but I feel like I'm getting towards the end of it all at this point. I feel like I just need to have a really good explore and a really good, like, tidy up everywhere. Okay, I did say I'd go to the shop, so... Go to the shop and also tidy up around the shop. Recipes. So we've done all those. We've done that, we've done that, we've done all of those. We've done all the water tank ones. And so I just need some duck eggs for the finder's keeper one. Okay, so just some duck eggs for Rudy and uh, stuff, a big stuffed pumpkin and then we're basically there on the recipes which is amazing. Ah, duck, you are gonna come and live on my farm. Here's a carrot. Go live on my farm. Ah, I found it. Look. It's above. I opened the gate down there. I knew what that was the second I saw it. Test the test the glue. Well, there's another like stinky trash pile down there as well. There's so many of them. There's actually way more than ten, so you don't have to worry too much about getting one that's like up a mountain or something stupid. It is starting to look better. I could easily clean up down there. See, that's, there's a box down there, but I don't feel like I need a box, really. Uh, that might be, like, showing me the way. Something even cooler. Just don't know. I feel like every time I go into this game, though, that I'm, I'm finding out something more. Whee! I'll take this box. It will be mine. Okay. And this has been opened, and that means I can grab the suitcase. And it has components and books in it, which is really cool. 
So not a necessary one, but maybe necessary if you do need components, if you're desperate for extra components. Yeah, I am going to do the bits I can do down here. Even though half of them will probably fall in the water. Let's get the suction on ahead of time. Anything else down here? No, I think this is all clear except for this thing that I can't get rid of. As far as I'm aware, anyway. No, don't think so. Worth, worth a try, you know. I want to grab the one on the other side as well. I need to have a look at how much wood I've managed to pick up because a lot of this clearing out will give me things like the wood that I need. And yes, by the time I finish playing this, the whole thing probably will be clean. And then I'm going to just clean up this little bit and then I'm going to um, go down to where I passed out yesterday and go up the ladder there. Because I, I was like, I was so confused because I was about to go up the ladder and I hadn't noticed the time. And all of a sudden I was passing out at the exact second I was supposed to be popping out somewhere else. I was like, what's going on? So we, we shall try again at a, a more considerate time. this little bit here and then we're all clean in this little section oh except for these bits over here around this house and that little peninsula there i feel like i'm gonna run out of time if i carry on doing this though well maybe not it's only like two little trash piles And I need to pop out, uh, pop through the underground and pop out that on the other side of the river there and do the other side as well. And we'll grab that trash pile. Yeah, all done on this side, which is fantastic. And I also apparently replenished my water, so I'm going to head into... Oh no, hang on. A little bit there that I missed. Ooh, and a suitcase. Very nice. Paired meals, boxes, all sorts of stuff over there. That's really good. Um, also, it looks like if I drop down there, there's another suitcase. But it's getting to the point where if I do all these things, this, this, all these little bits and pieces up here, there's not going to be any time for me to do the other things I want to do, but, oh man. I kind of feel like I had to. So let's just run back up again. So that one's all done. <laughs> Have to get all the suitcases. Might miss a recipe otherwise. Yeah, it's still four o'clock. We've still got six hours, okay? <laughs> Unless I get distracted by something else, we should be fine. I'm going to ignore the trash here, okay? We'll get it later. I will clean up up here later on, though. Definitely. So, when I ran through here, and I ran through here, there was like a little ladder going up, and I want to know where that goes, because I'm kind of interested. Could be somewhere very boring that I've already been to. Oh, interesting. Okay. 
Oh, this is super cool because this is a this is a duck that you wouldn't find anywhere else. Blueberry seeds. There's a suitcase up here. I, mean, I don't have any carrots for you right now, Mr. Duck. Sorry. This is where you find ultimate fruit salad recipe. So there you go. And I need that for my quest. And I'm almost certain I'll need a kitchen upgrade for that as well. But yeah, this is what I was missing out on. I don't think I can go anywhere else, but uh, that was definitely worth getting that recipe. I can't leave this a mess. No, 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 no. I don't know if I'll be able to do much more today. Um, we shall have to see. Oh man, there's a trash under here. I try my best to be so tidy and oh, another book. This is why you need to, to hoover up all the trash, guys. Good stuff. You get good stuff in it. <laughs> Okay, so let's go. I can say I don't know if I think I might be better off just cleaning up this area in general rather than trying to run all the way to the next area. Maybe if I just clean this one up. Do all the little bits and pieces around here. That will be enough. I'm going to double check that there's no way across the river from here because that would be a cool shortcut. That should be a very cool shortcut if you could get across the river. I don't think you can though. But yeah, we've... I think we've done most of the trash up the top here. There's a big trash heap over there. What am I on about? I haven't done it at all. That's the thing, I could either spend my time trying to run into somewhere that I know I probably won't be able to get to, or I can just spend my time cleaning up this area before I pass out. So I think I know which one I think would be most useful. So yeah, if we look along the river there, it does look to me like there's no way getting across there except for coming out from the underground. And then it looks like you can get up the hill a little bit from there as well. I've not tried to do that yet. It looks like there might be a campsite over there as well. But then I don't think you can get up there. It looks like there might be a ladder though up to that section. So that's interesting. That's super interesting. Okay, I'm going to carry on just along the road. And I'm just going to carry on doing a bit of tidy up. Can I get behind here? Yep, so I feel confident that the area around Rudy is all lovely and clean now. So I'm gonna... Stray bits of dirt here. Yeah, that whole section has been done, it's been cleaned, it's all good. I know, I'm a bit over thorough, but I, 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 that's far what I like about the game. Okay, so let's start by cleaning this, and we'll just work our way forward. Oh no. Well, I'll still carry on drilling, and I'll come back here, and I'll pick it up later. Honestly, glue will probably go. Will probably stack. I've probably got a lot, quite a big stack of glue in there somewhere. I expect. Ah. Okay, those glues are not going anywhere. But it's nearly, it's nearly time, guys, for me to. 
pass out and go back home, so... <laughs> it's cool. I wonder if there's any, like... There's probably, like, a cool suitcase or something under a lot of these piles of junk. I just want to get this little strip of land sorted. Hmm. And that's me knocked out. But there's another um, another one there. So there's so many of those trash piles that you could uh, easily use. But that, I think, my friends, is the end of this episode. So we got the upgrade to the purple, uh, the rubber waste removing drill bit. Um, we've also got uh, the upgraded kitchen unlocked and a couple of other things. I need to upgrade the kitchen one more time. So that we could, I very much expect the ultimate fruit salad will probably be that. And also the, the, the big stuffed pumpkin. So I'm going to need those for those other unlocks. So I need to get the kitchen upgraded and get all the ingredients together for those. Um, we've got quite a few quests still to do in the Lonely Hills. We know about 15 of them. There's still like six quests that so we don't even know what they are. I still need to try and save the ducks. I've done two out of five, so I need three more carrots. I need to plant carrots for that. I need to carry on exploring until I can get to the bottom of the hole. I need to repair that deer woodlet. I need to work out how to get Olivier salad. I think I might have the recipe for that, but I'm not certain. I need to find one more key part, and I need to cook the ultimate salad, and then I've pretty much done all of the, the stuff here. So that's, that's my plan. That's what I'm going to do. Just carry on trying to do those things and carry on trying to clean up the valley as well i think i'm getting i'm doing quite well actually i feel like i'm i've done a big chunk of it there so i feel like i'm quite accomplished honestly so i'm going to carry on doing that so i hope you enjoyed the episode if you did then please do leave me a like below if you'd like to see more no place like home please subscribe i'll let you know when the videos are out i hope to see you next time and in the meantime please look after yourselves and keep being awesome